I declare that I have worked with the National Democratic Front and I am not ashamed of it. I have worked with them, not for them, in my role as a journalist, along with then minority leader Aquilino Pimentel. As a young senator, I have worked for the release of captives, both in the police and the military establishment, from the mountains of Davao to the jungles and mountains of Sorsogon in Bicol and in Lianga Surigao Sur. I have agreed with them on many subject matters close to our heart, and I'm certain that our brilliant lawyer from Cavite will agree that all the elements, the four aspects of CASER must be pushed. Having said that, Mr. President, I would like the anti-terror law to be reviewed. I recall, and I hope my vote was, was uh, recorded correctly when I was in the House of Representatives at height of the pandemic because I did not vote in its favor. And I do not recall what law or what pronouncement of government has declared the Communist Party of the Philippines or similar organizations, movements, beliefs, associations could be declared as what? Enemies of the state? It's so difficult to identify that when if you see, if we see and study what they actually believe and want, it is social justice. It is really uplifting our people from poverty for decades without, without bearing arms, of course. And the disposition of forces is part of the four elements of CASEL. I am in the military establishment. I studied GSC and NDCP. I proudly belong to the AFP Reserve Corps, being a full colonel. I fully respect and associate myself with some of the views and the concerns of the good senator. However, I also would not pass judgment and label, perhaps, certain organizations whose beliefs may be different from the general majority but when we look at it we bear similar uh, objectives vision dreams for our people i say that not in contrary to my good friend senator tolentino's manifestation today or those who wish to associate with them I stand here as someone who has worked with the so-called left of this country and was admired many of those who share the same vision for a country who may belong to those who are considered left of center. And there is nothing wrong with that, Mr. President. It does not make anyone subversive. In fact, there's no subversion law. Now, if we are called terrorists for believing in certain beliefs which are considered left, then that's a longer debate altogether.